Hi, I'm Greg Peterson of the Peterson Farm Brothers. If you've seen our videos, you know we're proud to be farmers. Farming can be dangerous. Never assume location or depth of underground utilities or pipelines. Before you start any work on your farm, call 811 or visit clickbeforeyoudig.com to have underground lines located. It only takes a minute and can save your life. Never assume the location or depth of underground lines. Always call 811 or visit clickbeforeyoudig.com before you start work. A message from the Pipeline Operators for Ag Safety Campaign. Earlier, we were asking for people in class, kind of an underground understory here at 99X Morning X. What is the, what do we call we're it? Investigative report. Investigative reports. We were trying to go inside America's classrooms and have a student call uh, covertly with, with their, their cell, cell phone, phone yeah. in class. He's on eight. Hey, what's going on? Hey, I'm in government class. So what's your name? John. 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 Now, you're in which class? Government. Jimmy, uh, he's government the one class. who has to whisper, not you. Oh, I don't have to whisper. What school, what school do you go to? Walker. Walker? Yeah. Where is that? Marietta. Marietta. Are you in the yeah. back of the class? Yeah. Okay, hold the phone then. Let us hear what's going on. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes. 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 We're doing an exam. Wait, we want to hear more. We're doing an exam. What's he talking about? How does this guy know? He's calling radio stations. Are you going to do well on this test? <laughs> no, wait. I don't understand. How are you hiding yourself talking on the phone in school and class? Probably ducking behind the person in front of him. I've got... The phone's in his shirt. And I'm like lying on top of the phone's in his shirt. It's about to get. What's busted. the teacher's name? Mr. Phillips. Yeah. Mr. Can you tell Mr. Phillips we need to talk to him right away? <laughs> I, I think you should ask a question. Is there a question yeah, yeah, you can yeah, ask yeah. about ask the test? Ask a question. What? Ask a Is question. Is there something Raise you can hand. ask about the test? Raise your hand and ask a question. Okay. Hang on. Yeah. Excellent idea, Barnes. Hang on. I gotta figure out where we are. And we have, you know, we already, we already talked about, you know, why the president's power is broke. I have no idea what we're talking about. Well, come okay. on, get caught up. Ask okay. him, ask him this, you ready? Yeah. What? Ask him, what are the five branches uh, of government again? <laughs> I forgot. That's what I want you to ask. Just listen to what he's saying for about five seconds and then ask a question about it. Okay. The same way Barnes slid through school. Yes. <laughs> if you ask a question... Every officer is always... Hey. Hey, he's going ask. Wait, even like, even like the Speaker of the House? No, no, no. Definitely when you talk about... Good work. You got a big shirt. We're, we're working towards uh, bigger stuff. Okay, now, I will give you... What concert do you want to go see? Alanis? You want to see Alanis Morissette? Um, Alanis and uh, her band. Okay, Alanis. Sure. I'd love it. If you can get the teacher on the phone, tell him it's a very important call that just came in. From Barnes, Leslie, and Jimmy on 99X. Is he an older guy? Uh, no, he's younger. Yeah, tell him he's got a very important phone call. Coach, uh, coach. Coach in government um, class. Coach. Don't don't get mad at me, but uh, you got a really important phone call. It's, uh, it's like, hang on, I'm about to get killed here, and I'm going to kill you guys. It's Barnes, Leslie, and Jimmy on 99X. Why? Because oh we're trying to win some concert tickets. For me? Well, I guess I could take you. If I get an F or, like, suspension, I'm coming down We'll there. write you a note. Okay. Will you say hi? Yeah. Please? Well, we need All to right, talk. Okay, hang on. Here he is. <laughs> Hello. Hey, Coach. Yeah. We've been trying to get a hold of you. Hey, it's Barnes, Leslie, and Jimmy at 99X. Uh-huh. Uh, we just wanted to see what was going on, how the season looked. Uh, lo looks, looks pretty good. By the nice. way, John is a very serious student. Yeah. Oh, yes, he's very, very serious. Yeah. He just said if we needed to get a hold of you, we could call him here. Yeah. Oh, well, that, that's nice. That's nice of him. I'm glad he... Uh, yeah, we're in advanced placement government right now. Uh, what do you wait, coach? He's an AP. <laughs> what, what do you coach? Uh, I coach uh, wrestling. 
Wrestling? Hey, yeah. Like yeah. like World Championship Wrestling? Yeah, it's kind of like that. Uh, glow is actually what it is. Glow, <laughs> gorgeous ladies of wrestling. Yeah, that's yeah. I'm a high school level. You probably haven't seen it yet. It's very small. Will you say hi to your class there so we can hear them? Okay, yeah, uh, class, say hi. Hey! hey. All right, walk all right coach. We, we're sorry to interrupt the test. <laughs> Get on with the test. Okay. Come see us sometime. Okay. All right. Thanks. So put put our man back on for a minute. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Okay, hi. Dude. Yeah. You are in so much trouble, you have no idea. Yeah, as soon as you hang up <laughs> end on your call, you're in deep. Go for it. Okay. Good luck on the test. Thanks. See ya. Transitioning from being a Marine to a civilian was very hard. I lost my purpose. I lost the drive that I had. That is a very dark and lonely place to be. It took me surrendering to myself to get the help that I needed. At my very first Wounded Warrior Project event, I met Ray Pizarro. He told me, you need to have the courage to forgive yourself for the things you've done in the past. I got it tattooed on my hand. One night, my depression kept telling me, we can end this. And just before I was about to pull the trigger, I looked down at my hand and that's what saved my life that night. That was the beginning of my incredible journey with the Wounded Warrior Project. See how we help warriors combat stigma at woundedwarriorproject.org slash combat stigma.